You're watching My Peculiar Predilection on Discovery Life. This program depicts addictive behaviours that are dangerous and risky in nature. All persons and their behaviours are definitely, most certainly, indisputably, 100% real and factual. Viewers should not be stupid enough to attempt. My name is Tony Toff. I'm 21 years old. I work for the call centre department at Toxicare and... I'm addicted to putting ice lollies between my toes. Tony places four ice lollies between the toes of each foot, on the hour, every hour. That's 192 lollies every 24 hours. 1,344 a week. 75,264 a year. He's done this every day without fail since he was 18. That's... Mm, that's a hell of a lot of ice lollies. So far. I don't know why I started doing it. It could have been after my dad left me and I just needed something to distract myself. I've tried to talk him out of it before, and he nearly stabbed my eyes out with a Solero. There's nothing wrong with me. I have a job, I pay my way, I'm just a normal guy. We uh, hired Tony straight from school. Best employer we ever had. Actually, what I mean is, best value for money. He was under 18. After a year of working with us, he came to us and said he'd like to work from home under the 2010 Quality Act. He said he couldn't make it into the office anymore because he couldn't go outside and risk having his eyes all his mouth. We set him up a little office in his parents' home and he's been there ever since and it's working out quite well as it goes. We bought these fancy trays to collect the drippings. We siphoned it off every few hours to refreeze and recycle. It was supposed to cut down on his costs, but he said it wasn't the same. So now we just sell them at school fairs instead. I'm actually keeping people in work. Walls do me a bulk discount because I keep several of their warehouses in business. I like the mini milks the most. If I visit him, I have to wear shoe covers everywhere. He won't shower, and he only cleans himself by bathing with his feet hanging over the edge. I've been Tony's girlfriend since we were ten. We were soulmates, but I'm lactose intolerant, so ice cream makes me sneeze. And every time we sit in bed together, he gets the sheets all white and sticky. So I've given him an ultimatum. She said that if I didn't talk to someone within a month, then she's leaving me and moving in with the Bambenga pygmy people of the Congo. So my hands are tied. But at least my toes aren't. Because then I couldn't nestle lollies in them. Nestle, you get it? Nestle. Like nestle. 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 Because they make lollies. Tony needs to realise this is serious. We had to sublet our house because we couldn't afford to fund his lolly lifestyle. So, Tony has made the brave decision to speak to a psychiatrist about his addiction. He's even left the house to do it. Hello, come in. Some hat. My name is Charlotte Gormengast. I've been a psychiatrist for 15 years and today I'm going to help Tony overcome his addiction or compulsion to be precise. You need to realise your toes will get hypothermia. It's a wonder that they haven't already. This is serious stuff, Tony. You need to grow up and make some big boy decisions. Yeah, things are looking up. He's doing really well. I'm so proud of him. Well, it's been a month since I last touched an ice cream, let alone put one near my toes. This wasn't what I had in mind. I tried breadsticks instead, but they kept snapping. So we came up with a solution. Thanks to Dr Gormengast's cognitive behavioural therapy, after exactly six weeks and five days, Tony has finally kicked his addiction. Compulsion! 
I feel like I've got my whole life ahead of me with my amazing girlfriend and I just can't wait to give it my all. We're honestly ending the episode there. Yeah, I'm still breaking up with you.